Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Pisces, June 28, 2022. Transits now inspire new and even breakthrough thinking. There can be unexpected benefits coming through someone, or you discover some incredibly inventive or positive ideas and attitudes through your interactions. Publishing or promotional efforts can be especially persuasive now. You're also more intuitive, quickly grasping concepts and applying them to your life. Increased or improved communication can enhance a connection. Later today, the moon moves into your intimacy sector. While you've been doing more diversifying and detaching these days, this moon transit can feel like a strong call to specialize or focus your energies. The celestial lineup today is quite harmonious, but you may find that it is just a little too genteel for your taste. However, it would be a good time to really get to know how you feel about someone special or how they feel about you. Although feelings can be turned on and off like a tap in your case, today, you may still find out something very interesting. Maintain the current state of your working relationships and professional agreements instead of making any quick changes now that the moon in Taurus has stationed void of course. Throughout the day, the lunar energy will be immensely sleepy and inactive, encouraging you to take a similar approach. You can assume more power and control later in the day when the moon enters Gemini. By then, the lunar energy will be mentally active, encouraging you to negotiate to assure that you and your constituents are on the same page. An opportunity to travel by air, or to advance your education in some way, could be brought to your attention today in a rather unusual way. Friends might approach you with the idea, or it could come via email or the internet. This can make a big difference to your future, so don't let the opportunity pass you by without at least considering it. And don't be surprised if more lucky breaks appear on the scene at this time. Go out and enjoy life to the full. You exude an inner calm and spontaneity that others find irresistible, so join in activities with them. Start a new hobby or visit an old friend. Whatever you do, reflect and find out what's been on your mind. When was the last time you played matchmaker? Think about setting up an old friend with a new acquaintance. No fair keeping all the good ones to yourself. You feel self-assured, capable of almost anything. If there is someone special you have your eye on, you convince them of your intention to get together in a more intimate way. Even if you have not already met someone, you can rely on your charm and naturalness to bring successes in any matters of the heart. It is important for you to be extra cautious today. Make sure you are calm and collected before you get behind the wheel of a car. Be sure to have a helmet on if you are riding your bike. Strong emotions that come up at this time are apt to trigger a physical response that could be quite powerful and even a bit violent. Be careful of such tendencies. Before you make any major decisions today run things past another person. The presence of a vibration encourages cooperation in consulting with another, resulting in far better decision making. Don't rush yourself, and if the person you want to have look things over isn't immediately available, wait until they are. Chances are you will be very glad you did. Consider getting together with someone special after your work is done for the day. Romance suits a vibration very well. Neptune's retrograde turn in Pisces today opens the doors to the past and second chances, just as Mars is urging you to fight for what you deserve across all the currencies in your life. This comes just as the Sun is spending his first full week in a fun, playful, romantic and creatively charged part of your chart, something that is putting him in harmony with Neptune. As the doors open to the past and second chances it is those things close to your heart that are under the solar spotlight today. A week after the sun's return to your romantic sector and while you are still adjusting to having the solar spotlight on matters of the heart, the moon returns to begin the lead up to tomorrow's new moon. While it is still early days in Venus, the planet of love is still three weeks away, the romantically charged lunar vibes of the next few days will give matters of the heart the kickstart they need. Our eyes in the sky. If you've been feeling down and somewhat isolated lately, it's time to leave those feelings behind and make more of an effort to interact with others today. 
And if you're the cheery type or typically a very social person, you'll be totally in your element, because all kinds of people can benefit from the day's upbeat moon Jupiter sextal energy. When this cheery, honesty promoting lunar aspect shows up, it encourages happiness, joy, cheerfulness, good fortune, harmony and all that other good stuff the universe is capable of conjuring up when the right planetary bodies are aligned in just the right way. A difficulty expressing our emotional needs generates conflict on an inner, psychological level. No matter how we seek to right the ship, our efforts fall short, causing us to feel inept and angry. On the surface, it may seem like we are facing a straightforward dilemma, yet challenging incidents, events, or interactions are really intended to serve as catalysts for deeper reflection and reconciliation of past wounds. It is now time to take responsibility for our feelings and to stand up for ourselves. With any luck, we can do this without taking our frustrations out on those who may simply be in our line of fire at the wrong time. Aim to be as intentional as possible in your words and deeds to unravel insecurities without creating collateral damage. New friendships are an extra special potential bonus to come out of this special meeting, so you'll be drawn to people who share similar views, hobbies, or attitudes. Opening yourself up to new and different opinions is beneficial under this cosmic landscape too, but embracing them is more of a temporary learning experience and probably won't lead to any type of long-lasting change in your life. Which is totally okay. You do you. After midnight, the moon conjuncts Venus, creating a romantic atmosphere. This meeting in chatty Gemini stimulates both our emotions and intellect, intensifying our social sensibilities. The mind is seen as a gateway to the heart. What we communicate is important, but extra emphasis should be placed on the tone in which we share our message. If our demeanor is pleasant and we express genuine curiosity about what another person says or believes, we can form powerful connections and engender real bonds. This is an ideal influence to link up with old friends or make new ones. We might also attract a new love interest. And the best way to get their attention will be to make it clear that you are not only listening to them, but that you hear them, and will remember the specifics later. At dawn, the Gemini moon sextals Jupiter in Aries, amplifying the day's good vibes. This aspect strengthens our inquisitiveness and idealism, giving us the confidence to make friends and influence people. We might use this aspect to gain exposure for our views or positions, or to network with people in positions of authority. We can also spotlight our leadership skills and define our niche in a field of expertise. Although we have a great deal of knowledge to share with others, we can be reticent to claim our proficiency or skill sets. Jupiter in bombastic Aries grants us the self-assurance to put ourselves out there, even if we are typically shy. The more people who are magnetically drawn into our sphere, the more connections we will have to support our causes. It can't hurt to have those in our corner who want to see us succeed.